I think the, the best the best reason to have one of these now is because it'll make you happy. And isn't isn't playing music all about being happy? Right? Isn't it, isn't it all, like, I smile when I, I used to have my managers here, and she'll tell you, I used to, when I would play, I would be really, like, I'd be really serious and very introspective. You know, to have, oftentimes it would be this face, where my eyebrows would turn into one eyebrow, like this, like I was she so She wasn't happy when she played, I wish I had a day job, a real nine to five. I wish I had a boss who would not let me go to lunch or go to the bathroom. Now she gets a Hammond, and it's... I really, this just makes me happy. There's nothing, I, I'm going to tell you how happy this made me, okay? Just sitting down, so the song originally, I'll just do it, um, right, was originally this song. Which is, um, I had the honor of recording this with the Billy Joel band. Which was epic because it was like them and then there was me. Liberty, but, really? Liberty's my, my drummer. That's cool. I don't I know. But anyway. So, like that sounds okay, right? That's okay. But I mean, what's cooler, that or like Right? I did that and then I went out and I bought these shoes. <laughs> no, 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 I'm serious. Like, if you go to my Facebook page, you'll Her see Hammond like, boots. These are my Hammond boots, and every time I play that, it sounds silly, I guess. Yeah. but every time, these are Doc Martens, but any, every time I play the Hammond, I put these boots on. It's true. It's true, because that's how happy it made me. Now, I will say this, because John, you've known me forever. Almost forever. Since before I was born. Yeah, that's about right. <laughs> I think so. I think that's about right. Um, and when I... I was sitting in uh, the Marriott in Anaheim this past this past uh, January at uh, at the NAM convention. Does everybody know what the NAM show yeah. is? Yeah, basically. Okay, kind of. Um, and it was, I went downstairs before everybody woke up because I was sharing a room with my manager and my publicist and this other vocalist friend of ours. And I went downstairs and there was this guy sitting next to me who was trying to determine whether or not to get oatmeal. And I said, Yeah, yeah, I get the oatmeal. It's really good here. And I had had it. And it was good. And um, and we started talking, and he said, you look awfully familiar. And I said, oh, um, I don't know, what do you do? And he told me he works for this tech company, blah, blah, blah. And, uh, and he said, gee, you look familiar. I've seen your face before. And I said, oh, maybe you saw me in Keyboard Magazine. And he said, oh, that's it, that's it, that's it, right? You play her, uh, the brand that's not Hammond Organ. And I said, <laughs> but, but I said, you know, what's so funny is I just signed with Hammond. And he, he literally looked at me, and he goes, Whoa, so you can play. <laughs> and I just went, I, what does that mean? But I realized the legacy that I was joining and the bigness and the, the family. The family, and it is, and it is, and it's a happy family, isn't it? I think so. The best one, the, the best one was Dr. Lonnie Smith at the NAM show. Dr. Lonnie Smith, if you don't know who Dr. Lonnie Smith was, he's the dean. You know who Dr. Lonnie Smith is, I'll bet. Oh, yeah. They buy their hats at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Doc, Doc is the uh, dean of jazz organists right now. He's, he's the last of the greats. Everybody else has died. Doc, Doc is the man. And at the NAMM show, this was two years ago, there was a girl about 11 or 12 years old with her, she was a, with her father who was a dealer. And she came and she was watching Doc play. And Doc says, do you play? And she goes, yeah, I play, but I'm not very good. And Doc says, would you like to play for me? She goes, no, I'm, I'm not very good. I, I don't want to play. I'm not very good. And Doc stopped, and he looked at her, and he said, do you love it? She goes, yes, I do. He goes, then you're one of us. <laughs> he goes, you'll get good. He goes, if you love it, you're one of us. You're part of the family. And that's what it is. And it's, I, you know, I mean, I, I'm lucky. I get to meet great artists like, like, like Kamiko. I, I, I'm very lucky that I've gotten to meet most of my keyboard heroes throughout my life. The Hammond guys, I haven't met a jerk yet. I'm going to say guys, that's sexist, men and women. I haven't met a jerk yet because we're all, the Hammond family is really something. 
and it's because we all get off on this benevolent addiction and this divine uh, obsession that we have with this instrument. And nobody's, me the, the other thing is like nobody's, I've endorsed a number of brands in my life and I have to say, when I came to the Hammond HQ in the secret undisclosed location in the, <laughs> in the bunker, um, nobody was mean, everybody was so nice and they were, I was so surprised when I looked at the Hammond, like they have the, this wall of fame, which is Sort of a wall of fame. No, oh, it's, 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 it's the uh, it's the family tree, basically. Well, it's it's, it's our hall, our brand new hall of fame. Right, and uh, and it was so interesting because there were so many artists on there, different styles of music, different levels of playing. Some people are lead players, some people are not lead players. Some people play jazz, some people play rock and pop, and it just it was so interesting because for me, like Hammond always signified gospel music or church music and and then the SK1 series came out and it was like oh and I said to uh, my my rep stupidly right I said oh SK that stands for stage keyboard doesn't it and he was like yes it does honey it does it does and it, but it made perfect sense to me because for someone like me I never thought that I would be playing one of these and now I can't imagine ever Not playing, playing anything. It, right. yeah I mean really I can't imagine playing anything else so um,